Today's video will be replacing this leaking hose bib and this is going to be on the exterior of the building. Turn off your main water supply. This is going to be uh, incoming water to your house or unit. This is going to be on the other side of the building. Here I just opened up the valve and this is just allowing the water to drain. So here the water stopped draining. You can see I'm just kind of prepping everything and right now I'm going to uh, torch this end and remove it. Here I have my torch ready and basically what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start melting off this old solder. I'm going to use this as I'm melting it to kind of wiggle it so I can remove it. to help cool it off. I'm going to clean up the lines so I can install the new hose bib. Now you want to clean up the lines. There's going to be debris on it. You want to clean the lines as best as you can. So here we're just applying our flux. Now we're going to put on our spigot and this is going to be a half inch. Just make sure you keep the lines open when you're soldering. You don't want to melt the components inside. Here before we solder, you can take a wet rag if you want and just kind of leave it over the hose bib. This will kind of protect it as you're heating everything up. But I also have this, this is like a heat absorbing gel and it just helps protect the components. And basically what you do is just kind of spray it around and this will just help keep it from overheating and protecting the gaskets inside. We're going to heat up our pipe and we're going to apply our solder. Basically when you're heating it up you want to do right here and right here you never want to do it right on the joint. You want to heat up the side and then heat up this side as well and the joint itself will start to actually get hot and allow this solder to melt easily. Your holes bib off. Turn the water back on. Once you turn the water back on, go ahead and check for leaks. This video was a help. If it was informational, please subscribe.